Hi, so today we're going to be staying in the oldest hotel in the UK. You might be able to see it behind me. So, that's what we're going to be doing tonight. We're going to see what, what's around, what's it got, and then at night time it's going to be even worse. It's going to be a fun, uh, fun night for me, but I'm alone. And uh, yeah, I'm staying in the oldest hotel in the UK. Let's go check in and uh, let's see what it's like. Let's go. Time for some facts about this mysterious hotel. The Old Hall Hotel is located in Buxton. It's one of the oldest buildings in the town. This hotel was originally built in 1573, but was then later rebuilt in 1670. The hotel was used at times between 1576 and 1578 to house Mary, Queen of Scots. While she was in the custody of the Earl on the orders of Queen Elizabeth I, her last visit to Buxton was in the summer of 1584. Oh my god, look, that is so strange. Oh my god. Well, right now I'm in a bit, I didn't even know how to open it at first. Um, I'm really, really scared right now. This is so scary. I'm in an old lift. Oh my god, look at this. Listen to it. Oh my god, this is so scary. Like, Oh my god, I'm in. I know it's the oldest hotel. Did you hear that drop? Oh, I nearly dropped my phone. This is unbelievable. Let's see if we can get out. Can I get out? Yeah, we can get out. Guys, oh my god. This is so weird. I mean, if I run up and show you, wait there, wait there. This is what I've just had to do. I mean, you have to like shut the cage. I've never seen a lift like it. Like, literally shut the cage on it and just like shut the. Oh my god. Wow, literally only just got here and the lift is already really, really scary. I'm not taking that again, I'm gonna take the stairs, but we're gonna go to the room now. I don't know what's going on. This is, um, I'm so scared. As if I'm doing this. Right, so we just got to the room and um, it's very, very creepy. Um, I'm gonna show you around, I'm gonna do a little room tour. Um, I'm not going in that lift again, but little room tour is coming up. This is, uh, I, don't, I don't know what I'm doing with myself here. Um, but little room tour coming up. I'm gonna show you around. Let's go. Well, at least I've saved this for me. Drinks of tea. I don't even like tea, but I've got biscuits, milk. I've got the lot, and this is even creepier as well. Like stuff like this just creeps me out, and I'm gonna stay here on my own. Like someone help me. Bed is massive. Look at this. The sofa was down there, which um, I just sat on, and yeah, it's uh, what. It's a big bed. Oh, that's nice. I'm gonna try and show you the room sort of like this now. If you come around here, which is even weirder, like just a massive, massive wardrobe that I am. Um, you can see what's inside it. Oh, it doesn't even open. <laughs> I don't even wanna see what's inside it. That looks really, very really weird. Okay, now what we're gonna do, we're gonna go to the bathroom. Um, let's see if it looks old or nah. I don't think it will. Right, bathroom. Oh, that's actually quite nice to be fair. It's not very warm. Hi. It's very warm in here. Um, that actually looks really nice. Um, but as you can see, it's uh, it's not too bad. Um, I just think at night it's gonna be very creepy. Yeah. Ooh. Let's see what's in these drawers. Um. Oh, oh, oh. Not good. And then an old fireplace, which is even scarier. Great. So, you've basically seen most of the room. They've left me some water that I've missed out in the video. Left me a big bottle of water. Uh, and they've even got a little old fashioned like phone, which is, yeah, um, not for me. Not for me, I'm really, I'm gonna be really scared. We're gonna see what the view is like out of the curtains. Let's have a look. Look how old these curtains are. I mean, this is just disgusting. Um, yeah, I'm not feeling that. It's gonna be very scary. But here we go. We're gonna see what's around. We're gonna look to see what I can do, which is around. Um, and then we'll come back later on. And then we'll do a, a, um, a tour of the whole hotel. We're gonna be going around it like later on at night, see what it's got basically. Um, and I'm gonna look I'm gonna look online in a minute and uh, see what it's got. So that's the uh, hotel, that's the room hotel room of a hotel that was built in 1572 um which obviously they've done some things to it so it doesn't look as creepy but still very creepy especially if you're going at night so here we go 
I'm gonna go and have a look, see what's around. I'll video it as well. Um, I'll put that on. Um, so I'll have a look. But I don't think there'll be much around because again, it's a really odd place. But we'll see. Right. Well, we're gonna have a look what's around um, because I don't think there's much because it's such an old place. We're gonna have a look around. I'm getting a bit hungry, so we do need some food. I'm already on the maps and I can't see much right now. I have gone up here. Ooh, okay. There's a brewery. Let's drink some beer. Yes. Okay. Um, Domino's. Hmm. Not too bad, not too bad. Okay, there's not much around, I don't think. I think you can tell that this place is so old because there's not much around. There's not a house. We'll check that out later. We can go around there later. Under here. Oh, there's a spa. Okay. Still open. Might be able to make it. I don't think there's much around, really. Um, I think my plan is now just to go out, find a place to eat, and then sort of just have a look around, see what's around, because at the minute I'm lost. Even on the maps, I'm so lost right now. Yeah, there's nothing around. But the plan will be just to go and find some food. Okay, so we're gonna go out, we're gonna find something to eat, and then we're just gonna have a look around. And I'll take you on a ride with me, let's go. Enjoy a few clips of me doing nothing. So here I am, just laying on the bed, and I'm sitting down, and then I'm in the shower, and then for some reason, I'm jumping out of the wardrobe. <laughs> and then I am just laying on the uh, sofa watching a bit of telly, and that was me for the last hour. Great. Okay, so I'm walking down the high street, and I think we're in luck, because I found myself a little pub. Let's go try it out. This is the little pub I found. Actually looks quite nice. Let's go try it out, just get some food. I'm hungry. Let's go, come on. Okay, right. So I've just finished eating, and then as I was eating, I found online that there's a temple somewhere, but the only problem is the temple is through this big forest and currently it's 8 p.m and i think it's gonna get dark and it's like a 20 minute hike there i'm gonna show you like the whole trail and i'm really uh, scared right now yeah so it's a whole like foresty thing sort of trail i don't really know i just searched it and off we go i mean we're gonna try and find a temple that's the end goal is to find this temple so let's start the walk got my backpack i um i even bought some water i mean i'm not a hiking professional but all I've got is a backpack and add in some water. I think that's what you need, right, for a hike? I think. So this is what we're going to be doing for 20 minutes, by the way. And I'm wearing night shoes and fluffy trousers. That's right. We've got some fluffy trousers on. Why not? I've got to keep warm as we're hiking. So we're going up. We're still going up. And we're still going up. And this is going to happen for 20 minutes till we find a temple. So wish me luck. Um, if the video doesn't get uploaded, and then please come looking for me. Thanks. I mean, oh God, this is going to be interesting. All right, I've been walking six minutes. I'm actually taking a little rest. This is hard work. All this to find a temple. And as you can see, it's actually getting dark already. I'm scared. Like, I'm just, I'm just, I don't know why I've done this. 20 minute walk, 200 views. Um, that's been in my head. We are in the middle of a forest, trying to find a temple. <sighs> and all I've got is a bag, like I said before, some water. Actually, I think in my bag, I've got um, got some cream eggs. Um, so one cream egg will, will survive. You know, if we get stuck out here, maybe a little nibble of the cream egg. Once every, oh, I don't know, 10 minutes. Probably not, but we're gonna carry on going. We just gotta keep going, don't we, really? Um, we got, how long we got? Six minutes, I think. We've got about six minutes left. I've been walking for about 12 minutes now. So we keep pushing. Wish me luck still, I mean, yeah. It'll be fun when we get there. That's the main thing. Come on, let's go. So I was walking randomly and I've actually found a mate, but it was quite scary when I first seen it. You ready? Say hello, this is Barry. Say hi to Barry, um, he's my new friend on this walk. It's quite cool, he just sits here all day. I'd love to do that. Well, well, after 20 minutes of walking, we have found this Solomon's Temple. So we're not far away, to be fair. We are getting there now. Um, got the name Solomon's Temple, 1800s. Wow, it's gonna be interesting. Let's see how far away we are now, because I'm hoping we're not too far away. As you can tell, I'm out of breath. Um, we've been walking for 20 minutes, so 
Literally, I am out of breath now. It doesn't look like it's nowhere near, so that's why we still got far to go. Just gonna climb over this thing. Oh, see my fluffy trousers. I'm good. Yeah. Actually, saying that, I think we can see it just over there. So there it is. We're not too far away. Let's go. It's currently raining, and I have a new hairstyle. Finally made it. I don't know if you can hear me, it's very, very windy. There it is inside. Oh my god. I'm glad we made it. That was a long walk. I feel like I'm gonna fall down these stairs now. It's not very uh, stable. Here we are. We are at the top. Wow. That looks good. Look at that. Finally made it, but now I'm gonna walk back down. It's gonna be really dark in the forest, so and there it is where we came from. There we go, we're at the top, and I'm out of breath. <laughs> that was hard, and I'm holding on because I'm scared of heights. I'm actually stood right in the middle um, because I don't want to go to the edge because I don't like it. <laughs> there you go, we made it. Now we've got to walk back. I'm looking forward to that because it's all downhill. The other thing is it's gonna be dark, so yeah. Ah, oh, there we go. Oh. Right, that is that adventure finished. Walking back now. I don't even think I just said that sentence right. Just really tired. Uh, but we're gonna go back to the hotel. I wanna show you when it's really dark, because then it's gonna be spooky. And that's what we want. That's what we want from this video. So I'm already spooked out. Um, we're gonna go and uh, find our friend now. Let's go find him. Um, I forgot what I called him actually. Um, I don't think, I can't remember. All right, let's go back to the hotel and I'm gonna show you. And look who I just found. I remember his name, by the way. It's Barry. See you in a bit, Barry. I ain't coming back. Okay, so we're gonna to have to be very quiet because it is midnight and the floorboards are just so creamy. Oh my God. And these are the stairs. Turn the camera around. This is bad. So, this is the hotel. I wanted to take us around just to see what's around for a minute. I don't want myself to say, but we're going to now. Also, this whole video, I've just been looking at myself rather than the camera. <laughs> but, oh well. reception area and um, we're gonna go all around the hotel and see what's around. It's still gotta be quite quiet as you can see around me. This is so creepy right now, like very creepy. And there's people coming right now. It's just creepy when someone moves, but we're gonna quickly go have a look around. This is so scary, especially at midnight, like not feeling it, but we'll see. <laughs> And I find that very creepy that the hotel has got a piano. Um, yeah, this is probably one of the scariest rooms ever. I mean, I just don't like it. It's so quiet and you can hear the footsteps. There you go. Oh. Okay, right, we're gonna move on because I'm really scared. I've got to get out of here. And here we go. Oh, oh. Ah, oh, this doesn't get any better, does it? No, you're allowed to open it. There's a door, but I don't know where I'm going. I think it's locked. Yeah, you can't open it. It's a locked door. Sorry, I had to close from the mouth there. But I don't know where I'm going. Okay. Oh my god. I am so scared. What was that? It's 
Maybe not right now. Is that I'm not walking around anymore. I feel like the staff are just gonna come after me. I'm not doing it. Um, yeah, that was the whole hotel that we've just um, visited. <laughs> we've gone around and um, I'm not doing it anymore. That was too scary for me. I'll update you in the morning because it's quite late now. So I'm gonna get some sleep. And then what we're we gonna do tomorrow morning, wake up, we're gonna go down for breakfast. I'm gonna see what that's like. I think that's gonna be creepy. I hope, I hope they don't serve a creepy breakfast. <laughs> But well, that is that, and I shall see you in the morning. I forgot one thing, it's press up time. Press up's in the oldest hotel in the UK. Who's done that before? Good morning. So I woke up and I realized I was that tired. I filmed them the wrong way around. But after I brushed my teeth, I went down for breakfast. And for some reason I was playing with the sugar cubes. I don't ask me why, I was that bored. Um, and this is now going to be my breakfast. Are you ready? Look at that. That's kind of a full English. And that is that. That's the journey over. We're going to go home now because I'm finished there. It was very scary, that experience. The breakfast was so creepy because it was so, so quiet. Um, and I, yeah, I didn't. It was so just awkward. Like, you walked in, everything was just now quiet. They needed like a little bit of music on. I didn't film at the hotel because um, outside of it, there was a. It was a fair, like a Comic Con thing. Wish I got a video of it, but I didn't. But we're going to go back now. Um, on to the next journey. I'll see you there.